Have you guys ever wondered how I'm hitting insane clips in Fortnite like this and oh. dropping high elimination wins? Well, it's actually because of gear up. See, without gear up, my ping is normally around 20 to 30 and it's unstable, with me barely being able to build at all. But now I'm using it and it's lowered it from all the way 0 to 10 with no packet loss at all, allowing me to hit crazy clips just like this. Oh my god! Brando, it's not. Oh my. On top of it lowering my ping, a lot of pros use gear up like Miro, Re, and Asian Jeff. These are some of the top placing pros, so you know it's not bannable at all. Gear up is insanely easy to use as well. Just one click and your game is completely boosted. Don't worry though, if you're on console, gear up has something just for you. It's called Hyper Rev. It is a router meant to lower your latency just like the app would on PC. So hurry up and download it with the link below and let me know, is it working for you? Are you dropping higher elimination wins? We are back with more of the amazing settings that I know you guys love so much. First off, we're jumping into it. Just like always, we have our scuff, reflex, FPS, mouse click triggers, mouse click bumpers, four back paddles. Yes, I know you guys are used to the pink and green controller, but that one recently broke on me. So I sent it in to get repaired and we are using our old white and gray one. But don't worry, everything still works the same. It still works absolutely amazing. And we are going to go through everything today. All the paddles, binds, brightness settings, everything. Let's just hop right on into it. Going from our displays first, just normal full screen, 1920 by 1080. Nothing too special there. As I've told you guys before, my FPS is capped in the game files to 357. So this does say 60, but it is not at 60. Our brightness recently, I've just been playing on a solid 100. It's looked good to me this season. No user interface. Nothing different on the colorblind. It all looks good to me. 
my 3d res is at zero percent i i don't know why at all it's always been that way and then everything for me else is low 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 show fps on everything is low that's what you need jumping into the audio everyone's audio is a little bit different so everyone can kind of go off their own stuff i use you know normal stuff i use visual sound effects all that there's nothing too crazy in the audio not not that you guys would really care about i do play on east central is my competitive server but east is the main server i play on auto open doors mantle activation and hurdle activation is hold jump and press jump hold the swap pickup make sure you guys are using the setting is one of the most overpowered settings in the game it's just really really good and same with auto pickup weapons if you guys are playing a tournament or losing a lot of 50 50s make sure you turn this on now our preferred item slots we are using a shotgun in the first slot smg then normally it's heals but i just kind of let it unassign itself and then it's an assault rifle right at the end now for my pre-edits i do play with pre-edits on it gives you less edit delay if you guys have ever seen anything on that it is completely true and i do not use edit on release or reset i don't think it's good at all contextual tips i have it off everything else is all kind of personal preference off off this these fov things don't mean anything but it's all all max and make sure you turn these two bottom settings to off and off they will give you way more fps and way lower input delay now looking over at our hud we just have basically on on list hit and icons and maximum number scale i like really seeing when i'm frying people i like seeing the number it looks really good i was going to go through this quick you guys can copy this if you want but it's all kind of personal preference stuff don't use these gyro settings if someone's recommended them to you or a friend has don't use these all right stop it now you do not want to use gyro settings at all they are not worth it they're horrible jumping over to our keyboard settings they're kind of the same they haven't changed at all 3.1 3.1 this is on 1600 dpi by the way with a 50 50 targeting and scope sense with a 115 percent and a 115 percent building and editing sensitivity and when i do play keyword and mouse i turn both of these settings on because it does give you even more even more even less input delay and then these are my custom movement settings that i'm using i actually got these from 2x brando so don't tell them i'm leaking these to you and if you guys do want to know the mouse i use is a razor cobra pro with the 8k dongle and i use a wooting 60 he now we'll just kind of go through my binds real quick on keyboard because i do play it from time to time we're just going to go through some of the main ones like i use wall is q floor is f stairs are e roof is left shift and i use v to edit and then i use scroll or reset which is all pretty standard but now jumping into the juicy stuff that i know you guys really care about this is the most important part of the entire video edit hold time 0 0.100 this does not matter slide hold time 0 0.085 this does matter for keyboard and controller this is what i think is the perfect in between of sliding it's just try it out for yourself i think it's really good i don't mess with any of this pitch stuff at all and then vibration is just off we do not use that here it is not worth our time quick weapon we do not use that here either i think it's horrible probably one of the worst things they've ever added now for our build and edit we are at a 1.6 and 1.6 i know that sounds low but work with me here all right and then a 47 and a 53 look horizontal and vertical so i do play on expo and when you're on expo your look sensitivity needs to be a little bit higher but your building sensitivity needs to be lower and it makes your builds feel 20 times better and smoother once you get used to it you have to give yourself time on it though now for ads we are at 12 and 14 percent i give myself a little bit higher vertical that way i can control recoil since that's newer to the game now and then like i said i am on expo 100 percent strength and then dead zone right now is 7 7 which is pretty standard and i use foot controller because we want that little bit of extra aim assist we want that now going over our binds i don't think the binds like looking over them here do anything i don't like the new menu for it so we're just going to go back out and i'm going to explain them to you here build wise i'm using the normal builds like you know for cone all that it's all normal but for edit we are using left stick or r3 or no l3 depending on what platform you're on and then we are using a r1 confirm up top and a l2 reset so whenever we're going to reset we hit l2 and it resets it right there for us and then for everything else most of everything else is binded on a back paddle so for my right back paddle it is jump so whenever i press this i will oh, i will jump and then right above that right next to my right paddle is sprint so whenever i press it, i'm just going to sprint forward oh and we're on the ground and then on the other side on the left side we have our switch mode here and then above right above our switch mode is our pickaxe so those are all our back paddles 
and that's honestly that's all all our settings to be honest there's really not too much more to cover if you guys did enjoy this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe if you're new we are posting so many bangers daily hope you guys did enjoy that recent speed run we went absolutely crazy and if you guys haven't watched it make sure you guys watch it i'll have it linked in this end of the video here but i love you guys and i will see you in the next one peace